Hello, baby girl. This is Toast Baby, and guess what? I'm late again, but there is a new car in GTA Online, and I don't know much about it, but I do know that it is ridiculously expensive, and... Oh. Uh, and it has weapon. You can get machine guns on it once again. Okay, so, um, this looks like it's going to be another sports car, probably. And at $1.6 million, actually, where does that put that compared to the, um, well, the Pariah is $1.4 million. That thing is just god tier in sports. And what was, uh, what was, uh, the, the other Ocelot one? Shit. 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 That one. The Ocelot Lynx, $1.7 million. So it is cheaper than the Lynx. Fun fact. Uh, which, this is the most expensive sports car in the game. Uh, I think, then the prize second most, and then we'll see if this, I don't know if this was a sports car or not, but we're going to see, but first, uh, actually, no. I'll just get this in my, in my main garage, I'll move it to where I want to have it, or if I want to keep it, then I'll move it there. Okay, so, we are going to move it to here, and then we just need to go pick it up and see what Rockstar was thinking. If they were thinking. Alright, coming in for a landing... And now we can go ahead and get out and see how this new vehicle works. Oh, and in here. Oh, my, ooh, hey, it's delivered. As the garage confirmed. Oh, fuck. Hold on. It's being confirmed. Been confirmed delivered to garage number three. God, I got it. Yes. Thank God I made a script this time. All right. So, and I just need to head up to the top. All right. And here it is. And let's see what kind of car it is. Sports car. All right. So a four, another four-door sports car. It's not a hybrid. There is exhaust. Let's get this thing modified. Um, I'm not going to put guns on it because it's just a waste of money. Um, yeah, I couldn't didn't put guns on that one. Or did I never? Yeah, another one. But you can get guns on it. Probably 100 grand. Don't even bother because all the weapon mounted or the vehicle mounted guns are absolute crap. But anyway, let's get this thing modified and see if it's actually worth your money. I'm going to say no. All right, and here she is. So apparently, you can buy camo liveries for this car. Um. I guess because you can have machine guns, but you couldn't buy the camo libraries for the other cars with machine guns on it. Also, one with the green interior because it is correct. Uh, let's go ahead and see what this Cadillac uh, looks, how, how it works. Uh, let's go ahead and go to ground. And because you can put camo on it, and because you can have guns, that must mean, especially for this price, that must mean that this is explosive resistant. So we're going to go ahead and test that out. Because, I mean, for $1.6 million, guns and camo, it's got to be able to take an explosion. Oh, it can't. Alright, so, this can't take an explosion, costs $1.6 million, and can have machine guns on it and can take camo. But, let's see how it is. Uh, one thing I have noticed so far is this does have very, very good acceleration. Uh, traction in the corners, not so much, but this thing really does take off very well, which is it. Four-wheel drive. Okay, so it's four-wheel drive. So that's probably why it has good acceleration. But, I mean, look at this. Stand still. Going. Going. And we're already flying. So this does have very good acceleration. Not too good in the corners. Uh, that probably helps if I'm actually driving with the controller. But um, it's pretty, pretty quick. I must say, especially for a four-door car. Doesn't have any armor on it, though. So you're kind of on your own for, you know, getting this thing moving. Or getting this thing protected. What am I, hold on, what am I trying to say with this? Anyway, uh, good acceleration, it's okay in the corners, it seems pretty heavy, so you're not going to be knocking it out of the way, uh, not heavy enough to tank an explosion, though, because it's not an armored vehicle, um, but for 1.6 million, if you're looking for a four-door car to drive your friends around in, uh, Karuma, or the, uh, Armored Shafter V12, if you're looking for an, uh, a sports car that can annihilate everyone else, Pariah, for 200 grand less, that annihilates literally everything else in the sports class, or just get an elegy for free. Well, that's not four door, but well, you know, sports car. But um, yeah, this don't don't buy it unless you just really have to have it for some reason. But it doesn't stand out in any particular field. It's just another expensive car. So yeah, I'll see you guys for the next one. Love ya Mwah, on your bum.